NASA says it has heard from the Voyager 2 spacecraft, which right now is in interstellar space. Voyager 2, launched by NASA in August 1977, is no ordinary spacecraft. Over 47 years after it embarked on its mission, it is still surprising us with groundbreaking discoveries. Designed during a time when modern technology as we know it was just a dream, Voyager 2 has defied all expectations, exploring realms of space that were once considered unreachable. What makes this spacecraft truly extraordinary is not just how long it's been functioning, but the sheer distance it has traveled. Voyager 2, along with its twin, Voyager 1, has journeyed farther from Earth than any other human-made object. Both spacecraft have passed through the solar system and ventured into interstellar space, a region few scientists thought we'd ever reach in our lifetimes. Originally designed for a mission to explore the outer planets, Voyager 2 provided us with stunning images and invaluable data from Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. But the real surprise came when it sailed beyond these giants, into the great unknown, interstellar space, the vast emptiness between stars. And now, even after nearly five decades, Voyager 2 is sending back data that's revolutionizing our understanding of the cosmos. Recently, NASA announced that Voyager 2 had made a discovery that scientists once thought impossible. In the deep, mysterious realm beyond the solar system, Voyager 2 has encountered phenomena that challenge our current models of space. What exactly has this intrepid explorer uncovered? Let's dive in. Before we explore Voyager 2's recent discoveries, it's important to understand the environment it's traveling through. Right now, Voyager 2 is in a region called interstellar space, beyond the influence of our sun. It's a place where the solar wind, a stream of charged particles emitted by the sun, meets the interstellar medium, the tenuous mix of gas, dust, and cosmic rays that fills the space between stars. The boundary that separates our solar system from interstellar space is known as the heliopause. For years, scientists believed that this boundary would be smooth and static, like a shoreline where the sun's influence quietly ends and the galaxy begins. But Voyager 2 has shown us that this boundary is anything but calm. In fact, the heliopause is far more turbulent and dynamic than we ever imagined. As Voyager 2 crossed the heliopause in 2018, it began to send back data that shocked scientists. The spacecraft recorded unexpected fluctuations in the density of particles in interstellar space, something that contradicted previous models. Instead of finding a uniform, empty void, Voyager 2 detected sudden spikes in particle density, followed by long stretches of emptiness. This suggests that interstellar space is much more complex than we once thought. This finding forces us to rethink the nature of the heliosphere, the protective bubble created by the sun's solar wind. Scientists had always assumed that this bubble was relatively stable, but Voyager 2's data suggests that the outer edge of our solar system is filled with waves and ripples, potentially caused by interactions between the solar wind and the interstellar medium. These ripples could extend far beyond the sun's influence, shaping the very structure of the space around us. One of the most exciting aspects of Voyager 2's recent findings is how it reveals the true nature of interstellar space. Previously, scientists believed that once a spacecraft exited the heliosphere, it would enter a relatively calm, static environment. But Voyager 2 has shown us that the interstellar medium is far from still. It's dynamic, with constant changes in particle density, magnetic fields, and cosmic ray activity. This discovery is groundbreaking because it challenges long-held assumptions about space. Voyager 2's data reveals that the interstellar medium behaves in ways we never anticipated, with particle density rising and falling unpredictably. What could be causing these fluctuations? Scientists are still trying to figure that out. Some theories suggest that these variations may be the result of shock waves from distant supernova explosions, remnants of stars that have long since died. Others propose that there may be unknown forces at play in the vast emptiness between stars. In addition to particle density, Voyager 2 has also detected an increase in cosmic rays, high-energy particles that originate from outside our solar system. While the spacecraft has been encountering cosmic rays since it first crossed into interstellar space, the latest data indicates a significant uptick in their intensity. This suggests that Voyager 2 may be passing through a particularly active region of space, where cosmic rays are more concentrated than expected. These findings have sparked a new wave of curiosity among scientists as they try to understand the source of these cosmic rays. 
Are they coming from a distant supernova, or could they be the result of other, less understood astrophysical processes? Whatever the answer, Voyager 2's discoveries are reshaping how we think about interstellar space and the forces that govern it. Voyager 2's discoveries also have major implications for how we understand our solar system's place in the galaxy. The heliosphere, once thought to be a clear and distinct boundary, is now seen as a much more dynamic and turbulent region. This could change how we think about the solar wind's interaction with the interstellar medium, and even how space weather affects planets like Earth. Space weather, caused by interactions between the solar wind and the interstellar medium, can produce shock waves and other disturbances that travel through the solar system. These disturbances can affect planetary atmospheres, magnetic fields, and even the climate. Understanding how the interstellar medium behaves could help scientists predict space weather events with greater accuracy, potentially safeguarding Earth from harmful solar storms in the future. Moreover, Voyager 2's findings might help us better understand the boundaries of other star systems. If our solar system's heliopause is turbulent, it's possible that other stars have similarly complex boundaries. This could reshape our understanding of how stars interact with the galaxy as a whole, providing new insights into the structure and evolution of the cosmos. Voyager 2's discoveries are not just of academic interest. They could have real-world implications for future space exploration. As humanity sets its sights on sending spacecraft even farther into interstellar space, understanding the conditions of this vast, mysterious region becomes increasingly important. Voyager 2 has shown us that interstellar space is much more varied and dynamic than we once thought. This means that future spacecraft will need to be designed with these challenges in mind. Engineers will have to account for fluctuations in particle density, increased cosmic ray activity, and the possibility of encountering shock waves or other disturbances. These factors could affect the design of spacecraft, the types of instruments they carry, and the strategies for communicating with Earth over long distances. Additionally, Voyager 2's remarkable longevity, operating for nearly five decades, is a testament to the durability of its design and the ingenuity of the scientists and engineers who built it. Future interstellar missions will need to build on the lessons learned from Voyager, creating spacecraft that can survive for even longer periods in the harsh environment of deep space. Voyager 2's success also raises important questions about the future of human space exploration. While Voyager 2 is a robotic mission, its findings will be crucial for preparing humans for long-duration space travel. As we look towards sending astronauts to Mars and beyond, we'll need to understand how to protect them from the dangers of cosmic rays and other space hazards. Voyager 2's data could help scientists develop better shielding techniques and other protective measures to ensure the safety of astronauts on future missions. Beyond its immediate impact on space exploration, Voyager 2's discoveries could also influence other fields of science and technology. For example, the study of cosmic rays is important for understanding high-energy particles, which play a crucial role in fundamental physics. Cosmic rays can also affect biological systems, which has implications for fields ranging from medicine to material science. Voyager 2's data could provide new insights into how high-energy particles interact with matter leading to advancements in fields like radiation therapy or the development of new materials that can withstand extreme environments. The spacecraft's findings might also help scientists better understand how cosmic rays influence planetary atmospheres, potentially shedding light on the role these particles play in climate and atmospheric dynamics. In addition, Voyager 2's discovery of the turbulent nature of the interstellar medium could have implications for our understanding of star formation. Turbulence plays a key role in how gas and dust clump together to form stars. And Voyager 2's data offers a rare glimpse into how these processes unfold in interstellar space. This could help scientists refine their models of how stars and galaxies form and evolve over time. As Voyager 2 continues its journey deeper into interstellar space, it reminds us of the incredible potential of long-term scientific missions. In an era where rapid technological advancements are the norm, Voyager 2 stands as a testament to the value of patience and persistence. For nearly five decades, it has been collecting data, and its most important discoveries are only now coming to light. The success of Voyager 2 also underscores the importance of investing in missions that can operate over long time scales. While many modern missions are designed for short-term exploration, 
Voyager 2 has shown that some of the most profound discoveries come from long-duration missions that continue to collect data well beyond their original goals. As we look to the future of space exploration, it's clear that Voyager 2 will continue to inspire generations of scientists, engineers, and space enthusiasts. Its journey is far from over, and who knows what new discoveries await in the vast unknown of interstellar space. One thing is certain, Voyager 2's legacy will live on, not just in the data it has collected, but in the spirit of exploration it embodies. It has shown us that the universe is far more complex, beautiful, and mysterious than we ever imagined. And as long as Voyager 2 continues to send its faint signals back to Earth, we'll be listening, eager to learn more about the great unknown.